Hi everybody, so somebody sent me the soulmate tic-tac math to do and I thought how cute um, and so far I couldn't find that anybody had explained what happened so I thought I'd do it. So what you're supposed to do is write down your partner's age and then put two zeros after it. That's kind of like multiplying their age by 100. And then you subtract the year you were born and you use four digits. Then you add the current year, so it's 2021, we're going to add that. Um, and then be blown away when you get your partner's age followed by your age, and that says, they're your soulmate. So let's try it. So let's say your partner's 34. We're going to write down 3400, so that age followed by two zeros. And let's say you were born in 1991. So we're going to take 3400, subtract 1991, and we get 1409. Now we're going to add the year, which is 2021, and we get 3430. What just happened? Well, if you were born in 1991 and it's 2021, that means you're 30, so you have 3430. It means your partner's 34, you're 30, and oh my god, you're married to your soulmate, or you're with your soulmate. Spoiler alert. According to this TikTok or this little math trick, we're all with our soulmates, right? And how is that possible? How are we all so smart that we ended up with our soulmate? Let's try it a different way. So if I take my math, the 3400 minus 1991, which is 1409, I add the 2021, I get 3430, I'm just going to rewrite it horizontally, right? That's how we usually do math. So I have my 3400 minus 1991, I'm going to skip the subtotal, and I'm going to go ahead and add the 2021. Now watch, I'm just going to do this little trick where I'm gonna switch the order. So I'm gonna put the 2021 first and the 1991 later. Remember, we can do that. Or doesn't matter when we add and subtract. And I put parentheses to make you think about what just happened. Well, what happens if I take the year you were born, subtract it from the year it is, it says that's how old you are. So that would be your age. So when I put that together, the 3400, the two zeros give a place for your age to go in. So we have our 3430, there's your soulmate math. Let's just write it generically to say, like, we don't have to know how old somebody is. Um, in math, when we don't want to know the answer, we want to put in something blank, we put in XY. So XY would be whoever's age, followed by two zeros. And I put 2021, but this would work next year in 2022 as well. But you put the year minus the year you were born, and of course, that's going to give your age. So let's call your age AB. Well, if I add XY, zero, zero to AB, I get XYAB, and there's your soulmate.